What's going on guys? Back at it again with another Fallout 3 video. So in the last video we basically went around the little lamp light caverns uh, where we're at right now and we talked to pretty much all the NPCs but somebody brought to my attention that I actually didn't talk to all the NPCs that there's this guy named Zip or something like that and I guess he's like the little scientist guy uh, here. I don't really know where he likes to hang out so pretty much we're gonna go look for it look for him i think he might be the way into uh vault uh into the vault that we're trying to go to i think it's vault 87 right um yeah vault 87 so it <clears throat> so it's going to be interesting to say the least um so let's go find him but first things first do me a huge favor drop a like on this video also subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed because it really does help this channel grow so with that being said Let's go ahead and get going. Um, I wanna. Oh wait, is this him? Oh, talk about lucky. The mayor said it's okay for you to be in here, right? Because <laughs> Mungos aren't allowed in here unless the mayor says so. So are you an okay Mungo? Because if you aren't an okay Mungo, then that means we should stop you. And that means I've got to get my gun from lockdown. Just stay here, okay? My God, this dude even talks fast, and you can tell he was like. I think that's why they call him Zip, because he's like a little speedy guy or whatever. Uh, no, no, I'm not here to cause any problems. You don't need your gun. Oh, that's good because Mayor McCready says I can't have my gun in town anywhere, not since last time. But that was totally an accident anyway. That reminds me, <laughs> got a nuka cola? Because if I'm not going to have a gun in town, then it must be okay for me to have one more nuka, right? Anyway, everyone calls me Zip, you know. Like a zipper. Only not really like that because I'm not made of metal. But I do go up and down, I guess. Sure. <laughs> I'm going to ask. Uh, you know what? Uh, I hope he doesn't... I hope they don't... I hope I don't give him... A Nuka Cola Quantum. Let's see. Yeah, more Nuka's always good. It's definitely always good than less. Because no Nuka's no good at all. Got any Nuka for me? I'll trade you whatever I got for more Nuka Cola. Anytime. You can for zip. You can for zip. God, dude, he is. He is on something for sure. Uh, what have you got to trade for a cold bottle of Nuka Cola? Last time I was out looking, I found some of this moot fruit. It's not as sweet as Nuka, but maybe you Mungos like that sort of thing. Eh, nah, I'm good. Maybe I'll have something better tomorrow. So don't drink that nuka. Save it for me. Save it for me. God, he's he's literally on something. Uh, why are they, why do, why are they why are you called Zip? Why Zip? Or why do I have a nickname at all? I mean, why don't people just call me Ricky or Yancey or Eustace P. Vanderbagger the Third? <laughs> I mean, they say it's because I'm so fast, but that doesn't make sense because I don't think I'm all that fast. It's just that they're all slow. I guess it's just one of those mysteries that will never really get answered. Sort of like how people made bubbles in Nuka Cola. Say, got any cola? Um, I think he drinks too much Nuka Cola. That's probably where he gets his energy. Um, I'm going away. You stay here, away from me. Okay. See you next time, Mister. So I was wrong. He's not a scientist type. Hey, sit. Come over here. Hey, I sit. I got a question about your last dad. There a problem, Claire? Everything's fine, right? Calm down, Zip. Hey! It's just you didn't bring any kindling down for cook fires. Only thing worse than fungus is cold fungus. You know what I mean? Oh damn, I knew I was putting something. Okay. Alright, let's go. I promise. Um I see what I I really have no idea where we're supposed to go. Let's go find McCready. I wanna try to talk to him one more time. I don't know where I'm hey. supposed to go, to be honest. Is this Nuka Cola Quantum? No, it's just an empty Nuka bottle. All right, let's go ahead and uh, find McCready. Maybe we could potentially gain access to the vault that way. I'm not sure, man. I'm really not sure. I don't remember. It's been so long since I've uh, played this whole storyline that I just don't remember how to get into Vault 87. Hmm... I know there's hold on so let's try talking to the girl again the guard girl because this is definitely murder pass and this is definitely the way I'm supposed to go but I'm not sure why or how I'm supposed to go over there Watch it. wait a minute there's a lever over here Aw, oh, man. 
All right. Excuse me. I've heard of you. You're one of the good guys. Um. I really need to get into Vault 87. Do you know the way? We don't go there. It's bad back there. Ask Mayor if you really want to know. Uh. Let me see. Uh, back gate. It's so. Okay. Here, let's just try this. I don't want to talk to her like this, but I'm going to try it anyways. Maybe it'll unlock a uh, new dialogue or something. Uh, probably not, though. Uh, shooting at me would have been a big mistake, kid. Oh, really? That's cute little imagination you've got. But if you want to play make-believe, maybe you should do it with the younger brat. Okay, so it doesn't look like it did. Damn, dude. I'm, I really need to get over there. So, let's go talk to McCready. I'm willing to bet McCready's the one that's gonna allow me to get out of here. But, I guess... I... I probably have something else that I have to do with him. Wait, who's this kid? I haven't talked to him yet. Hey! Oh, it's just a little lamplighter, that's why. Alright, let's go to the front gate. <coughs> maybe, uh... Maybe that's the way. Perhaps. Uh, this is knock knock. Does knock it knock makes have? It feel safer knowing you're around. I, thank you. Um, this is Watch Joseph. It. Let's see if Joseph has. What's any... Oh wait, that's Penny. Let me Pardon let me talk to Penny. Thanks for getting me back. I really miss my brother. Everyone calls you a Mungo, but I think you're an okay Mungo. Thank you. Why do you have the nickname Penny? It's not a nickname. My name's Penelope. They're just lazy and don't like saying the whole thing is all. <laughs> well, later. Glad you're safe, sweetheart. Um, there's McCready. Hey, come here. What now, Mungo? Shut up, McCready. Um, I need to get into the place, all right? So, do you know it's the way? It's not safe, even for someone as brave as you. There's monsters back there. So, you know the way to get there? Yeah, I do. It's through Murder Pass. Not a real safe way to go, but it's the only door that works. That's the only way? It's the only way that works, yeah. The other door hasn't worked since before I was here. Computer's busted and not even Joseph can make it work. Uh, where can I find Joseph? I'm the mayor, not a babysitter. Maybe he's back Whoops. there by the door. Fuck if I know. Uh, I want to use the mur- uh, I want to use Murder Pass to reach Vault 87. You sure about that? It's scary in there. Even I don't like going in there, and I'm really brave. Yes, I'm sure. Okay, if you say so. Come on, let's get the gate open for you, Mungo. Okay. I could have sworn I- Whoa, he's gone. Uh, I could have sworn I talked to him before about this, and it didn't have those dialogue options. I don't know, that's weird. Uh, the good thing is that it appears- like, well, two things. It appears like I finally got way uh, in there. And two, I think there's an alternate way to get in there if I talk to Joseph. It's, oh, you know what I think about? Uh, now that I think about it, it's probably through that one uh, place that looked like a vault. Remember? I don't know if you guys saw the last video. But in the last video, um, we found this place that kind of looked like a direct entrance to the... Um, to the vault. All right, let's go ahead and uh, let's talk to him and see if he has anything else to say. Okay, what the <clears throat> hell is wrong with you, Mungo? This it better be important. Um, bye. Yeah, that's <laughs> nice. Scr All right, now let's see what uh, uh, Princess has to say. Now that we got the gate open. Well, if it isn't the magnificent Mungo, what now? Doesn't look like she's gonna say anything. Yeah, I didn't think so. Let's go. Come on, dog meat. We got people to see. <clears throat> Door to murder pass. So, we know for sure there's going to be super mutants. Yep. Um... Oh, shit!
This dude has a freaking rocket launcher. Oh god, I hope I get some critical hits here. Oh, I was, I was lucky. Thank you, Mr. Stranger. Let's go this way really quick. I don't know what's over here. Well, I can tell you something that's over here. I can see a super mutant right over there. Well, that's nice. I still want to explore this, though. I, I was about to say, I hear another one. Die! I'm pretty sure I just blew off his head. Leave my dog alone. How dare you touch dog feet? You're not even allowed to breathe his air. All right. Oh no. Oh no, dog meat. Leave him alone, you brute. Holy shit, dude. There's a lot of super mutants here. How are you doing, dog meat? Where are you at? I mean, uh, yeah, he's fine. Dog meat's an absolute savage, dude. Um. No, nah, I don't want. Nah, I, I was about to wait. Or maybe I should. I don't know. Hello? Anybody alive out there? You know what? I think this is the way I'm supposed to go. So let's go ahead and go the other way. Because there might be some interesting things over there. I don't know. The good thing is that we finally got into Murder Pass. So let's see what happens once we get into the vault, right? All right, let's go ahead and uh, go back into Sneak. Because chances are there's more Super Mutants. These guys are pretty tough. I don't know if it's this weapon that's not that strong. There's another one right there. Or if these super mutants are just really, really strong. Or maybe both. Oh, wait, right here. Die! I was about to say, my god, are you gonna die or not? Dog me, damn it! Ooh, look. Uh, U.S. Army handy flamethrower recipes. Alright, let's go ahead and lockpick this real quick. Okay, so it's right here. I'll take the purified water and the stim pack. Stim pack and the right away. You know what? I'll take the blood pack too. Was there a blood pack in here? Because we have a, a perk thanks to the to Va Vince at uh, Medesi or whatever. The vampire dude, he gave us a, a perk when we became one of them, essentially. Oh, I can turn this on? Oh, it doesn't do anything. So this is... So this is a dead end. It probably hooks around. That's probably what ends up happening. Right? Because this way is caved in and there's nothing else over here. Alright, so let's go. Instead of dropping down, I'm going to see if we could go all the way around. There's prop... Oh, wait. No, there's. this is the way right here. I almost missed this. Alright, nothing down there. Oh, I found you. Come on. This dude's pretty much dead. I shot him in the wiener and he died, man. That's a that's a terrible way to die. There's another one up there somewhere. But I want to search this dude first. Alright. Gotta, gotta be on our toes. I guess this weapon isn't too bad. 
But I feel like the uh, A E three whatever fucking is. A, I think it's a better weapon than this. Oh, dog I need your assistance because this guy's gonna absolutely destroy me. I mean, uh, I, I didn't say I was gonna get destroyed. He was gonna get destroyed. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Alright, let's try right here. No. Alright, so this is it right here. Bam! I'm good. Damn, look at five stim packs. Don't mind if I do. I'll take the Rad X too. Why not? Uh, blood pack, stim pack, Rad X. Alright, can I sleep here? No. What's the point of having a bed, Super Mutant, if you're not gonna sleep on it? Um. All right, let's check this right here. Very easy. Damn. How many of these do I have to pick? All right. Here goes another one. All right. So it's gotta be right there. Blood pack. Blood pack. Stim packs four. Well, I mean, I'm getting, I'm coming up on stim packs. Let's see how many I have already. Uh, items, aid. Uh, 22 stim packs. Nice. The Wazer rifle, man. This, uh, this gun, I believe, has the unlimited. I forgot what the actual name of it is. But the, uh, it has the unlimited, uh, oh, wait a minute. I think we found the thing. But since that appears to be the way, let's go ahead and come this way. Yeah, I think it has the unlimited, uh, magazine size or whatever. Okay, yeah, this is the opposite side, so we could have gone that way. We would have actually been to the vault faster had we gone this way. And potentially faced less uh, opposition. So that's interesting. Alright, let me see. So it actually... Oh, wait a minute. Oh, no! Come here! No, not you. You. That took forever. Let's get some nice little headshots. Come on, baby. Done, he's broke. Let's search this body before it uh disappears into the abyss. It actually looks like this whole place was uh at some point barricaded. So, I mean it's probably little lamplight probably came all the way over here, but the super mutants broke down the barricade and the kids probably had to uh you know push back into the vault or into into the cave instead of closer to the vault disarm the tripwire i don't want a bull whatever the hell this is brahmin to fall on me what the hell's the point of this there's nothing over here it's a trap just for the sake of being a trap. I don't appreciate this. <laughs> uh, this gun's alright, I guess. It's not terrible. It's not great either, though. Uh, This gives me uh, What was this trap? This trap doesn't even have anything. Oh, wait. I see it. It's a bouquet of uh, grenades. There we go. Um, yeah, this same concept here. There's nothing here. What's the point of putting a trap if there's nothing there? Oh god. Um. Oh good. This is 95. Oh, it's a master too. Come on. Dog meat for the kill. You are nasty, Mr. Meat. 
That's his new name. Mr. Meat. Last name Meat, first name Dog. I love it. Keep out. Uh, not part of tour. So the cave was part of the tour. Um, scary. Got some rounds. Some caps. Uh, sensor modules for something. Well, crafting, but still. Get out of my way, Mr. B. Holy shit. Dog meat, are you okay? Yeah, he's fine. I'm the one with the freaking broken legs, though. So let's go ahead and uh, heal a little bit. Luckily, we found like 9 million stim packs earlier. Look at all this ammo I'm getting. Fuck, man. Of course. Of course I have to... Uh, lock. Uh, pick this lock. And just like that, I got my stim packs back. Dope. Yeah, Mr. Meat, um, definitely kind of screwed me over back then. Oh, look, we made it. Door to reactor chamber. You know what? I'm going back to sneak. You never know what's on the other on the other side of this, and I honestly don't remember at all. Picking up the trail, completed. So what's starting next? Finding the Garden of Eden. Well, this could be bad. Um. Holy shit. What the hell happened here? Oh, God. Alright, let's look over here first. Before we go downstairs. I don't like looking at these boxes. Because if they have stuff, it's always, uh, for the most part, just crafting. Holy shit. Alright, luckily these are just rad roaches, so let's get one each. Actually, this has a 95% chance, so let's go ahead and go with that. Um, that has a 90% chance. And 95 <laughs> Perfect. Oh, what the fuck? So there's one left, right? Where'd the other one go? Look at him. He thinks he's safe. He actually just didn't realize we were here. Oh, I definitely hear super mutants over there. All right. Well, I guess let's do this. Oh, shit. Die. Come on, give me some 95s on the head. Close, 94. That works, though. Look at that, see? One shot. Super mutant. You ain't got... You, ain't, you don't even stand a chance. No, not dog meat. Why do I want to target dog meat? Mr. Meat's a saint, all right? How dare you suggest I want to target Mr. Meat? Thank you, Mr. Meat. You've been a godsend. All right. Nail board. Oh, I'll nail. All right. Um, so I'm, I'm going up. Here, let's take a nap. Because shooting super mutants is exhausting. All right, let's come up here, cause uh, door to the living quarters. We sh should have went. You know what? We'll come back. Right now, let's go. Let's go find that alternate route that goes down before we go up. Um, it doesn't appear like these super beans are very strong, anyways. Okay, I thought this guy was still alive. All right, so it was this way. Let's go ahead and come in this direction. Did Dogmeat fight somebody? Yes. 
Mr. Meat. What is wrong with you, dude? No, give me the other guy. Look at him. He's hitting dog meat while simultaneously staring at me. Like, don't stare at me my eyes, Mr. Mr. Super Mutant. You might get a laser. You might get LASIK eye surgery. All right, let me see. Frag grenade, sure, why not? I really need to sell some more stuff. All right, what's in here? Empty, empty, empty. Yay, I love empty crates. All right, let's go this way. It appears that everyone is dead, though. But that's weird, though, that the uh, super mutant came from where we came from. I don't think I saw, unless it followed me over here. But I don't think I saw another alternate way. What's this? Peter Stevens uh, personal journals. Oh god, more reading. A lot more reading, it looks like. Oh, uh, data corrupted. Uh, I don't know what to do. Uh, my Jason, my little boy, he's gone. My wife won't talk anymore. She's, she just sits in this godforsaken sub-level and stares out of the window at the rock wall as if looking across a sunlight meadow or a lazy summertime lake. Jason was my life. He was my joy, my meaning. Now all this work seems pointless. This was a mistake. Better we had all died together outside than this. Damn. Permanent tomb. I'm scared. All right, uh, we read two, so let's read three. Okay, dead and corrupted, four, corrupted, five. Nothing has meaning to me anymore. Every time I'm on the, I'm in the outer tunnels, I swear I could hear children's laughter. Hey, those are the kids from Little Lamplight. The vault uh, doctors say it's just my mind, Compensa compensating for loss of Jason, but I know I'm not crazy. They gave me new pills, but pills are for crazy people. I refuse to take these pills. I am not crazy. Why bring up kids in a hellhole like this? Why? This is pointless. Uh, this is a pointless existence. Damn, dude. Uh, we were on five, so this is six. Corrupted. Seven. Uh, can't stand the sounds anymore. Take the pills they say why take them i am not crazy i'm not crazy jason's laughter no family gone forever stuck here for ever eternity end i am sane i am me i am forever oh he was turning into a super mutant I feel bad for the guy, man. Like, his kid died. Who, uh... According to him, was his life. Uh, I feel... I, I legitimately feel... Horrible for him. And the... The crate requires key. I wonder where this leads. You know what? That's probably the, uh... Other entrance to Little Lamp Light. It makes sense because this is where the doctor was or whatever and that's probably the tunnels he was talking about and that's probably where he heard the little lamp lighters um all right so this is destroyed so it looks like we have to go the other direction going up but everyone should be dead already so let's go ahead and legitimately run it was this way right yep Hurry up, Mr. Meat. We have a long trek ahead of us. Through the vault. Oh, God. Is it this way? Hold on. Uh, yep, it is this way. Let's go. Back into sneak, my friend. Alright, let's go, Mr. Meat. We gotta stay on our toes. Because these people... If you even want to call them people. These mutants... Ah! Um. Let's cripple his legs. I wonder how effective this would be. It's no. 
not very effective, is it? We should have just waited just a little bit longer. And uh, blasted his face. This guy got absolutely obliterated. Alright. 87. Oh god. What is this place? I'm trying to listen to see if there's anybody else in here. I can't hear anybody. We're, we're in caution now, though. Um, who's that stim pack I see? Stim pack, medics. You know what? Maybe I should take a medics, huh? Oops, medics. Let's go ahead and be in top tier shape. I kind of want to check upstairs first before I check downstairs, though. Um. Oh, there's a super mutant right there. But uh, what's over here? Looks like a dead end, possibly. Bunch of stuff here. I don't think I want to um pick any more locks. So if we find another pick, I probably. I probably won't pick it, man. Alright, let's go. This doesn't appear to be much over here. Let's go take out this super mutant that I saw a second ago. He's literally right over here. Come on. Quietly. There we go. Uh, 70. I mean, I guess it's better than zero. One more, baby. Woo! He's the headless mutant. Sorry, buddy. Oh, God. I can hear more footsteps. These guys have some really heavy footsteps, don't they? Or do I hear them? I don't know. It might be... It, it might just be dog meat. I'll take those. Let's take a quick nap so I can auto-save. And so we're in top-tier shape, of course. Um, how do I get upstairs? Darts? I don't even know what the darts are for, to be honest. Alright, so how the hell do I get upstairs? Um. Because we checked the whole bottom, right? And there is no way to go upstairs. Well, unless I missed something. It's, it might be in that one other room over there. Yeah, there's nothing in here. It might be in this room. I probably because I probably didn't search it enough. Nothing in here. All right. Well, nothing in here. How do I go upstairs? Oh. Wait. So I came from over there. I didn't even check this door. Uh oh. Uh oh. Definitely found a way. Turns out I just missed the door. Die! Nice try, buddy. Very hard. Damn it! I can't lock. I can't pick that. There's probably a key somewhere. Um. Nothing. Just some toilets, just in case I need to drop a deuce. Alright, let's see what's in here. Alright, that's like the atrium area. I'll come back to that. Uh, empty, empty, empty. Yay! Empty crates. I'll come back to that, because I'm pretty sure that's where I'm supposed to go. Although, I think this goes to the same place. Absolutely does. Oh, shit! Where'd you come from? Here's some, uh, nice little shots, buddy. Oh, fuck. I hate it when that happens. I wish you could cancel. Mr. Meat, I need your assistance. Alright, let's take this dude out real quick. No, I don't want to aim at Mr. Meat. No, switch, damn it. 
There we go, finally. Zero percent chance on the head. That's absurd. Come on, Mr. Me. Let's get all the shots we can. There we go. No, that's not what I wanted. Um, what did I need? I needed... Science? Hold on, let's, let's try this really quick. Um, what was it? It was, uh, Cyborg, I think? I mean, I could always get Sniper. You know, that's actually not a bad idea to get this. But hold on. Um, where's Cyborg? Cyborg, Science 60, Med 60. So let's go back. We'll put this down to 60. And then we'll put... What was it? Medicine? Oh, so close. Uh, 60 and 60. Yep. All right. So for now, let's go ahead and get Sniper. Let's uh, look at everything else and see if there's anything else we could potentially get. Although here now would be... Nah, Sniper Sniper's a better perk in my opinion. Um... Nah, I think we're good. Yeah, I think we're good. Sniper, sniper's the way to go. Alright, let's pick some of that up. Um, uh, I think we have to go this way, but... Wait, uh... Where's the other guy we killed? He literally disappeared. Shut up, super mutant. You don't deserve my time. Hell yeah. Um, this place, this side looks like a potential dead end. I want to open that just so that I know that I've been here. Wait a minute. What is this? This is a different room. Very hard. Oh, it could. I could have used a shortcut. That's what that one uh, master lock was. All right. I want to go that way. And realistically, that's probably the way to go. But I want to check what's over here first. Oh, found a super mutant. Let's get some nice little headshots on him. He's probably gonna die. And he didn't. Oh god. Um, I don't think I have enough. Dog meat, take your mouth, please. Dunskies. Holy shit, dude. But this dude was. This dude was a beast. He was a master, that's why. We got another terminal right there. But first, we got to make sure we pick up all of this stuff. If it's a, a lot of reading, I'm not going to read all that. Oh, there's a safe here. Can't pick it anyways. All right. Um, let me see. Maintenance code issue fixed. No, because this is just service. This is just service stuff. I don't really care. Although that probably will t would tell me what happened to the vault. If I had to guess, it was probably a nuclear meltdown or whatever and that's why you have super mutants in here but i don't know you don't i don't know it probably is right it's probably is wrong i guess we'll never find out right um that's an average lock i can't pick that i don't know where uh, i don't know if there's any keys for this place either caution game's over. no more game Oh, fuck. Let's get some headshots on these guys real quick. It's a brute. Oh, no. Don't be freaking pushing me, man. Now I gotta get hit a little. Die, damn it. Dog meat. 
Oh god, man. Dog meat's all alone. I gotta run. No, oh shit! Die. Where'd this guy come from? That guy's done. Alright, I gotta take this guy out before he kills dog meat. Never mind. <laughs> I can't underestimate dog meat, alright? Alright, I don't wanna go upstairs yet. I wanna do a little exploring really fast. Uh, which, by the way, I'm already low on health. I need to find a makeshift bed. Alright, let's go... This way. First. Because we came from there. Oh, dude, there's radiation. Nope. Dogby, get the fuck out of my way! You're gonna kill me, dude! Alright, I'm not going that way, then. There's definitely radiation. Um. Alright, let's search this. Nothing. This is a dead end, isn't it? I have to go through the radiation. Well, I mean, I guess it's not all bad. I have... I'll do a quick save right before we go down there. And, uh, I have Rad-X, I believe. So, we'll definitely use the Rad-X before we go deep. Although, wait, hold on. No, yeah, I came in from there. Alright, so let's, um... Well, first things first. Dog meat, stop fucking pushing me, dude. Alright, let's save it really quick. Uh, we'll save that one. Since that one's kind of no longer being used. Rad X, where's the Rad X? We'll take Rad X. And you know what? We'll take a few stim packs just to be safe. We're still getting a lot of rads. Wait, there's nothing over here? Dude, there's literally nothing over here. What the hell was the point of that? Um. Hmm. Wait, what's the mission again? Retrieve the Gek. Alright, so there's a Gek in here. Did I miss something? Oh, there's a. Uh... Oh, wait, fusion cells. What is this? Red X? Alright. I... Oh, I can pick this? Oh, it's because I have science up, don't I? Alright. Well, either way, it's going to take me a bit because I like to play the guessing game with these. Alright. Let's try this again. Come on, baby. Let's do it this time. Damn, come on. I'm gonna get lucky eventually. There we go. See? Told you. Alright, what does this do? Watch it just be unlock medical safe. Uh. Well, first things first, yes. 12 medical staff records. Any vault member marked as deceased by the special EEP section will be tagged and coded in the computer as an unexplained or un undefined death. This comes directly from the overseer of this vault, who will be personally inspecting your reports to make sure they are accurate. Please refrain from sending uh, inquiries or clarification requests to this office or the EEP chief physician. Please print out and give any next of kin form DV900L if they have questions. Disease listing. Of all 87 deceased individuals, total deceased, 93 natural deaths, 4 uh, accidental deaths, uh, de deaths, 2 unexplained, undefined, 87, huh. And then it just lists all of them. Alright, death code definitions, oh shit, hold on, uh, death code definitions, uh, the following are new revised death code definitions, please update all files to include these codes for faster handling note that criminal death suicides are never listed in these files as such they must be listed under code 008 in accidental deaths as per vault mandate um wow 
A008 is instant death syndrome? <laughs> what the fuck, dude? Alright, let's see what's in here. Water. Red X. Stim packs. I think I'm supposed to go that way, dude, to be honest. Holy shit, I'm over encumbered. Um, I always forget that I need to go... You know what? I don't need leather armor, do I? Let's go ahead and drop that. Uh, how much do I weigh? Dude, that weighed a lot. My god. Alright, let me see. Let's double check down here. Oh, yeah. It's uh, definitely a dead end. Um, oh, yeah. We didn't check up here. Look at that. Dead lady with a spatula. There's got to be something up here, dude. We're missing something. Test labs. Oh, God. This is going to be dangerous. Oh. Dude, I just blasted his gun off. He had an alternate, it looks like. Oh, I'm not going to be able to pick that. I hear somebody else. I think Dogby found him, to be honest. Oh, it's a centaur. Holy shit, they're testing super mutants. And it's very, very... Well, they're not testing super mutants. They're testing people and accidentally turning them into super mutants. Or maybe purposely? I don't know. Um, I'll wear your bones around my neck. You're gonna wear them? I don't know. I think my bones fetch a high price. Die! Oh, God. I almost, well, I did miss the first one. Here, let's click on this dead body. Uh, failed FEV subject. Yeah, I thought so. Get out of my way, dog meat. You're gonna get me killed. Um, this one's literally barricaded. There's a terminal here. Chief Physician's Terminal. Alright, entry. Alright, latest subjects in the Evolutionary Experimental Program, EEP, are showing some promise after only a single exposure to the modified FEV. We are currently testing five subjects, uh, two males and three females. Each one of them is under 24-hour observation as usual. We hope to have a breakthrough in this strain as uh, the... Continual pressure from vault and the military at Mariposa is becoming most bothersome. Uh-oh. Uh, incredible results. Only after three days, subject B440, B164, and D624, all our female specimen specimens are all exhibiting a unique change. Their bodies are undergoing severe physical changes, uh, losing most of their uh, visible female indicators and transforming into an almost asexual state they are also seeing increased upper body strength and muscle formation in the line in line with males similarity <coughs> similarly subjects c376 and a541 our male specimens are losing most of their visible male indicators and taking on the same asexual state as the females it seems that the FVV wishes to level the playing field and start with a clean slate as it works. Oh, God. Uh, we had a minor setback. Subject B440, Mary, Kella, clap, clap, whatever, uh, is now deceased. According to my autopsy, she died of a massive loss of brain function and is unable to sustain her basic bodily needs. This is the usual uh, pattern we see in all the FEV strains we test. The brains of this subject becoming uh, too damaged to support even the most basic human needs, eating, sleeping, etc. So far, all of all other subjects are nominal and continue to exhibit physical changes. All right, crap. At 10 days, uh, we are now noticing that the skin of all our remaining test subjects is actually thickening and becoming more resilient this seems to be the FEV bringing about some new adaptive change 
this is the kind of result we are looking for. Uh, adaptions that could prove useful in sub in uh, combat situations. I need to remember to congratulate Dr. Philo on his skin engineering. This code uh, instructions in this strain seems to be exactly what we expected. Last one. Once again, I've hit that damn wall at least 14 days. All of the best subjects began to exhibit severe bouts of ra uh, rage and anxiety. So much so that, they're, uh, that they were a danger to my team and this facility. I had no choice once again but to order them to be destroyed. It pains me every time uh, we do this. The same cycle has been repeated in every strain we test. We always see uh, superior physical adaptions, but the mental changes are their downfall. Damn. Looks like they were building something for the military, and, uh, well, long story short, it didn't really work, did it? Or maybe it did work, but it wasn't exactly what they were looking for, I guess? Um, hello? It can't be. Either you are quite real, or I am going quite mad. Could you actually be a pure human? Uh, yes, I'm human, but what are you? Me? You care who I am? Mm, forgive me. I... Uh, I'm not used to pleasantries, I'm more used to grunts and being struck about by the others. My name's Fox. I've lived in this cage all my life. How ironic that the others consider you a mutant of their kind. Yes, indeed it is ironic. Forgive my astonishment, but I hadn't expected to meet someone with such a learned outlook of these things. It is a pleasant change. I suppose I shouldn't be surprised. It was only a matter of time before someone like you showed up for the deck. Uh... What do you know about the geck? I know what it is. I know where it is. And best of all, I know how you can get your hands on it. Um... Why would you help me? Uh... Yeah, how, why would you help me? Because... You... Can help me! Let me out of this place! I can't take it anymore! I can't even recall how long I've been here! Take me with you! And I'll retrieve the Gek for you. Why would I have difficulty getting the Gek? The chamber in which the Gek resides is absolutely flooded with radiation. Yay! It's unlikely you'd survive very long. Myself, on the other hand, have surprisingly inherited a useful trait from my fellow meta-humans. I am highly resistant to radiation. Let me out of here, and I will place the Gek safely in your hands. Alright, sounds like I, uh, sounds like a deal. Uh, but two things. One, you cross me and I will blow a brain, I'll blow your brains out. And, uh, two, how do I get you out of there? At the end of the hallway, to your right is a maintenance room. Inside, you'll find the fire control console for the medical area. Uh, trip the alarm on it. And I'll be able to get out. Oh, a word of warning, though. Tripping the console activates a failed safe and will open all the recovery rooms in the medical area. Oh, God. So, what do you think? Can you do it? Yep, okay. It doesn't. How do I know his name? He never told us his name. But, alright, okay, Fox. You got a deal. I'm glad to see. You are a sensible person. 
Now, get me out of this place. I can't stand it anymore. Uh, do you know what the gag does? We can discuss this later. Right now, concentrate on getting this door open. All right, let's go. Um, I could always hack it if I had the hacking capabilities. Can I sleep here? Yes, but not with super mutants in the area. Dog me, come on. All right, I see somebody on the little bottom part. Let's go ahead and take everybody out first. Open this door and blast away. Oh, there's two of them. Blast away! Goodbye, Mr. Master. Come on. Shoot him in the nuts! Dunskies. Let me loot these guys. I'm pretty sure this is the terminal. I hope it's the terminal. Oh, dude, nope, it's not. Alright, well, let's continue going. Dog, we get over here. I know you probably found somebody, but we got other business to take care of, alright? Um, open door. Honestly, I don't even know where the hell I'm supposed to go. That requires a key, so it's got to be this way. I'm literally just guessing right now. Are you now? Cuz I think I'm going to splatter yours there, bruh. Did I just shoot Doggy? I hope I didn't. There's a terminal right there. Could that be the right terminal? Uh. Well, good. First try. Um. Unlock storage room door. No problem. I don't want to read all this right now, to be honest. Is this the storage room door? I guess. Game's over. Ah! I pushed the wrong button. Say goodnight, homeboy. Shit. There we go. There we go. I love headshots. Alright, let's search this. More ammo, don't mind if I do. Uh, does this do anything? Doesn't appear like it does. Meaning, I don't, I don't even know where I'm supposed to go. I'm gonna be honest, dude. I'm kinda just going along with the flow. Let's check this room really quick. This is the door that's locked. Yeah, this was the door that was locked. Alright, so that was just a... A quick way to bypass that room, which is kind of pointless, to be honest. No. Die! On criticals. Good. Saves me one round. Thank you, Mysterious Stranger. I don't know what I would have done if I had lost that one round. Is that the is that the terminal? Nope. Uh, and I don't think that thing does anything. Where is this place? I'm literally just killing a bunch of people. But I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Good, good. Nice. You guys are dunskies, bruh. It can't be this far, man, can it? Alright, well, this is the only way I can go. And this doesn't look like... Any... Oh, wait. Could this be it? Chamber terminal? Hold on, let's check this out real quick. Uh, seal radiation. Purge? No. This is the place where... Yeah, alright. Holy shit, that was quick. So this is where I need to go. 
But I'm not trying to go in there without Fox. So let's go ahead and backtrack because there's got to be a separate way to go. If I had to guess, it was the opposite direction to this place. And it has to be, to be honest, man, because realistically, dude, there's only two ways. Fallout 3 is somewhat linear in that sense. Wait, what's this? Uh, a safe. Holy shit, there's a lot of stuff here. First aid box. Uh, I'll take all of that. Thank you very much. Right away. There's a rat suit. I already have a rat suit, right? But question is, do I have it on me? It's a, an advanced one. I don't know. I'll take it just in case. Um. Yeah, I'll take it just in case, but I don't think I need it. I think I already have a red suit. I just don't know if it's an advanced one. And if I don't, I mean, I guess I have one. And, uh, and it is an advanced one, so that's good. Damn, dude, we went a long way. Now we got to backtrack to release Fox. All right. Well, I guess we can sleep now. Damn it. Does this, is this considering Fox as an enemy? Can I hack this? No. I need science of 75 to be able to do this. Oh, that's why. It's because of the centaurs. That's why I can't sleep. Hello. Nice to meet you, sir. I would like to trade. Oh shit. Oh shit. There's two of them. Ah! Come on, baby. Alright, we got one of them. Alright, good. Now he now I won't miss. How dare you shoot that dog beast? He's the patron saint of dogs. Alright. This gotta be it. It's gotta be it. Alright, come on, baby. Alright, I'm not gonna use up that last one. Is Dogby fighting someone? He is. How did this stupid centaur get out? Thank you, Dogby, for letting me know that there was a centaur back there. But right now, I gotta get Mr. Fox out of there. So let the guessing game begin. I hope this is the terminal. It is the maintenance terminal. So, he did say the maintenance terminal. It's gotta be this. Come on. Let this be the, the last time. Yay, it's not. Come on, baby. No, no, no. Come on, man. We gotta get Fox out of there. This is it. I can feel it. I can feel it. Come on, it's gonna be this one right here. Damn it. All right. Come on, baby. <laughs> maybe, maybe I should learn how to hack terminals. I just never cared about hacking terminals, man. There we go, we finally got it. I hate these mini games. It's the one thing about Fallout I don't like. Um. I'm just gonna fucking do it all. I don't even care. Oh, wait. Um. Is that it? Oh! Wait, who the fuck is this guy? Did I miss something? Why is he hostile? Whoa, what 
What's up, cutie? Come on. All right, let's go back to Fox really quick. And, uh... Is it here? It is here. Hi. Finally. Freedom! True freedom! <laughs> I cannot thank you enough for this gift. You have no idea how long I've pictured this moment in my mind. And it feels far better than I'd imagined. Now, for my part of the bargain, follow me. Yay! Oh, I got karma too. The good thing is that I've already killed everyone on this side. So this is going to be cake. I'm tempted to sleep, but if I sleep, I might, uh, he might just get away from me. You know what I mean? Look at that. Fox, are you proud of me? I destroyed everyone, making our life easier. Whoops. Let's step on this crummy super mutant. Dude, he is huge, man. My god. Fox, we have a long walk ahead of us, bro. Can you please pick it up a notch? I really like his outfit, dude. How it's all torn up and it says vault like it says 87 on the back. You can tell he was one of the vault dwellers. It's interesting how he's still uh, smart. You know what I mean? All right, we're getting close. Oh, I thought he was gonna use this thing. Haha! <laughs> you go that way. I'll go this way. Look, reunited, and it feels so good. OMG, Fox. We've got to be close to the end. I'm fairly confident that that green room is where the Gek is. Well, he said it was in there, and it was highly irradiated. And that place was highly irradiated. I mean, at my radiation level increased just by being close to the area. Speaking of which, let's go ahead and uh, take a rat away. There we go. Wait, miner? All right, well, let's take... We'll take two more. Fuck it. You no longer have radiation sickness. Good. I don't want to have radiation sickness. Oh my god, Fox. Can you walk any slower? Well, this is it. So I guess I guess we just wait. Um, hello? Okay. You stay here. Beyond this door, the hallways and chambers are flooded with radiation. I'll get the case and bring it right back. Keep your eyes open. I knew my lesser-minded brethren are bound to stumble across us. Yes, sir. God, now we gotta wait. Dog meat, you heard that, right? Keep your eyes open. You never know who's gonna be coming at any point. Uh oh, what's going on? Sounds like Fox opened a door. What is he doing in there? I don't know. I think he's coming back. Yeah, he's coming back. I can hear his big ass footsteps. All right, give me the gek now. What the hell is he looking for? I'm right here, dude. As promised. Yeah, here's the gek. I hope it's worth it. Uh, I'm afraid this is where. You and I part company. I'll find my way out of this place. Don't worry. Maybe we'll meet again somewhere in the, the wasteland. Yay, we got the Gek. 
Hell yeah, completed Escape from Vault 87. All right, well, we're definitely going to be doing that, but in the next video, unfortunately, seeing as we are already approximately 10 minutes over uh, the hour mark. So this was a great freaking episode. We found Fox, so that's, uh, that's amazing. Want? In the next video, we're definitely going to be continuing. We're going to escape the vault and see what happens with the main storyline. But if you enjoyed this video, do me a huge favor. Drop a like on this video. Also, subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed because it really does help this channel grow. So with that being said, catch you guys in the next one. Deuces.